Hey everybody, you're watching Behind the Wheel with Sarah on web2cars.com and today we are talking about this 2013 BMW 135 IS Coupe. It's a cute little sports car and I'm very excited to see just how sporty it is, but that means that I'm gonna have to try to learn stick shift again. So we brought in two experts, two stick shift experts that are gonna teach me, right? Tell me the basics of driving a stick shift. Okay, so foot on the brake. Okay, foot on, and let's turn it on. Okay, 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 okay. So let's put down the parking brake. Okay, how do you? Really <laughs> squeeze it. I'm so weak. <laughs> okay, so now in order to go forward, you are gonna slowly ease off the clutch uh -huh. at the same time that you're applying the gas. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, so now we're in first. So slowly so ease off the clutch and apply the gas like you did before. Into first, and we're going. And go straight back. Okay, I'm in first. <laughs> I'm in first. So now you're gonna hit the clutch. Okay, clutch and is down. Clutch is down and now shift into second. Oh, Am I in second? I think you're in third. What does that mean? I let go of the clutch, I let go of it. <laughs> now I'm just driving like a normal person. Okay, wait, stop, stop, stop. Okay, so I think that my limited expertise is not really helping Sarah too much. Let's get so, Andrew in here. Yeah, we're gonna bring in yeah. our A-team. <laughs> first explain to me just like what I need to do. Okay, so now imagine you have the motor, right? Mm -hmm. Well, you have to, first you have to imagine it. All your wheels and your differential and sure, all your fancy, sure. fancy mm -hmm. stuff. So okay. they rotate at different speeds. Sure. So when this one is rotating really fast, yes. it's the job of the clutch pedal, your left foot, My left to foot. bring those two spinning masses together to couple up and then rotate at the same speed. Of and course. that's that's you drive. Okay. I got my ticket for the long way round. Two bottles of whiskey for the way. And I sure would like some sweet honey. Okay. Now, in order to do that, you have to push your foot into the clutch, which uh -huh. decouples the engine from the transmission. Why do I have to shift? So, what you're gonna do now is, with, yeah, without, your, without even using the gas, uh -huh slowly with your left foot until you feel a bit of resistance and you feel the car start to kind of... Do you feel that? Now give yeah. it some gas. Just a little bit. And then when you feel that it's connected, then you take your foot off the clutch completely. And now to shift into second, uh -huh. what you're going to do is you're going to go clutch all the way in, uh -huh. straight back on the shifter, uh -huh. and then you're in second. And then clutch off. There you go. Second gear. Holy moly! Here we are underneath the hood of the um, 135 IS. And as you can see here, um, we have the twin power turbo, which is uh, BMW's engine for this model. And it's really- This um, is oh. BMW's twin power turbo 3.0 liter inline six motor. The car still only gets 23 MPG, which is not very good. But the MPG really isn't the matter here. If you're buying a BMW, you're buying it for sport, you're buying it for fun. This thing puts out about 320 horsepower and about 317 pound feet of torque, which is actually pretty stout given that the car is relatively short and with a small wheelbase, it should be pretty drift happy and fun to drive in general. That was the 2013 BMW 135 IS um, Coupe. Uh, it was a stick shift uh, and actually uh, both Lindsay and Andrew turned out to be fantastic teachers. I can almost drive it now. Hi right, Andrew, show me how it's done then. All right, let's do it. Okay, 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 okay.